Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Today is August 29, 2019. I'm in the City Hall of Columbia, Tennessee. To my right above is the 2018 World Grand Champion Tennessee Walking Horse Big Lick, Jen Amati. Jen Amati is owned by a gentleman here from Columbia, Tennessee named Mr. Mike Floyd. This horse is not homegrown in Murray County or Columbia. He was foaled out in Mississippi. Mr. Floyd bought the horse and then they were campaigning with this on his feet to become the world's grand champion. Years past, that horse would have exhibited in Neyland Stadium before 110,000 people. That day is gone because of the animal cruelty. That horse exhibited at a carnival called the Tennessee State Fair before 50 spectators. Because of this, right here, the world has said this is enough is enough, and Columbia, Tennessee, with this in the city hall, is providing legitimacy to animal cruelty. It's just that simple. Last week, there was a story, front page story in the Washington Post newspaper. In the article were pictures from the Big Lick Tennessee Horse Show, Tennessee Walking Horse Show here in Columbia, Tennessee. Columbia is the largest city in the state of Tennessee to host a multi-night Big Lick Tennessee Walking Show, Horse Show. Again, it's animal cruelty. The United States House of Representatives voted 333 to 96 on July 25, 2019. Representative Ted Yoho, Florida Congressman, Republican, went on the floor of the House, the Con United States House of Representatives, and he held this up and said, you're either for animal cruelty or you're against it. Ladies and gentlemen, this is animal cruelty. Columbia is providing legitimacy to it. Columbia is in the eye of the storm, so to speak. The city council in Nashville went on record on August the 7th. Congressman Tim Burchett, Knoxville, University of Tennessee, he voted to get rid of these things because it's a stain on the state of Tennessee. Let me hold up something else for you. This is a cartoon. It is in the uh, Chattanooga, Tennessee paper. Look at it. There's blood running down over the Big Lick horse. And here we have in Columbia, Tennessee, the Big Lick horse being put on the city hall wall. Ladies and gentlemen, there is Mayor Chas Mulder, who did not inherit this situation, but he owns it now, is responsible for this along with the city council. Something has to be done or Columbia is going to have protesters out in front of this city hall. And this is a great place. And there's great people living here. But folks, this is animal cruelty. United States House of Representatives has voted. And here you have it, Columbia, Tennessee. Big Lick Animal Cruelty, multi-night horse show, largest in the state. They make Cadillac SUVs right up the road from here. Folks, it's about the last opportunity for Columbia to divest itself of the stain. Let's see what they do. Maybe they will do the right thing. Today's August 29, 2019. If that picture's not down off of this wall first to next week, I think you're gonna see the United States of America and all the people that support abolishing the Big Lake Animal Cruelty way in on this city, this city council, and this mayor. Thank you so much. Thank you so very much.